Well, you checked uh, Roddy off the list of artists that people want to see you work with. Is there anybody else you really want to work with if for whatever reason it just hasn't aligned yet? Uh, nobody specifically. I mean, I always say Pharrell, but that's like more so I want him to executive produce a project later down the line if, if I'm able to, if he's able to. But uh, nobody specifically right now. I'm trying to focus on myself. Mm. Yeah. Nobody on the R&B side? Nah, pretty much work with a lot of people. I got to get back to the blast story. You've been on the Chico foundation shit recently for sure. Yeah, I've been I've been going I've been I've been feeling like T-Pain last year. Feature crazy. Feature crazy. Nowadays, let's say a major label calls. Mm-hmm. It's, a, it's a new artist they signed. You have no idea who it is, but they're on Atlantic. Yeah. And they want that blast sauce, that fucking <laughs> <laughs> What's that hitting for? Uh, you know, I never charge for a feature ever. Ever? No. Nah. Really? So you're doing it only if you truly want if to. If I do truly it. like the song. So you have to like the song. You have to like the artist? Yeah. I'm, t- I'm talking about up front. It's a back end cost. But if I like the song, I'm not going to give you that hassle. You feel me? The back end is just like a, a, the bag, or is it the. It may, pub? Be, the, it may be the video, the Royalties. pub. It may be the, the wardrobe for the video. Things of that nature. You feel me? Mm. Still got to show up as blast i'm still a brand i'm still a company but on the front end i'm not gonna be like i need 15 just to record the first i need you know yo it sucks too because a lot of artists will pay that to these features and then the song doesn't get clear yeah that, that's called called game they just take out the money already oh, hey hey get your money how you get it couldn't be me though what about you and t-pain that'll be crazy mm. I love T-Pain. Have you seen his uh, any of his covers? He just did a whole yep. cover album? Yep. I've been watching that. He did, he like did a, the... Uh, um, Ozzy Osbourne, War Pigs. Yep. He, did a, he did a lot of Sam shit. Cook. Sam Cook. He did Chris Stapleton, the country guy. All caught man. Yeah, T-Pain, a legend. You guys have never connected? Never connected. I think we were supposed to. I think I know his manager, actually, but he never got on the table officially. You got to make that happen, man. Yeah. Because you're kind of like the it hook, hook guy now, you know? Of, like, yeah, I need some songs. I need to ask him a thousand questions. When I did the video with Rick Ross, I asked him a thousand questions. What questions did you ask Rick Ross? I was like, what did you do with your first million? What did he say? He was like, the first thing I did, I saved it. Yeah. But he was telling me, he was like, because I told him I lived in L.A., he was like, that's the worst place to buy real estate, get something in Atlanta. Atlanta's for sale. It's a lot of land. Mm-hmm. So Also, the state taxes here suck. Yeah. Tell me about it. Are you realizing that now that you're rich? <laughs> I wouldn't say that, but well, yeah. Well, you got that guy Vic over there who'll give you some terrible tax advice according to TikTok. Oh. This motherfucker went viral. You could write your jewelry. You know how many CPAs have we hit my We already talked DA? about that, man. <laughs> <laughs> he cleared it up on the last interview. That's you know funny. what you got to do? You got to set up the address in Nevada, buy a house out there, just let it sit, or just have some people rent it, but all the bills are in your name. Hey, I'll take all the advice. And then you pay st- no state tax because Nevada's... That's what you do? No, but a rapper who you have a lot of songs with does that. Um, hmm. Yeah. He's from L.A. Interesting. He likes a lot of songs? More than hey. two? No, I think you only have one or two with him. Okay. okay. I think... Ish. Whatever. Yeah. yeah. Not a lot of songs.